Let's now look at normalization in Audacity. So this is basically a process to help you make sure your volume is okay. It's not too loud, it's not too quiet, it's normalized. Now I've got my finished recording in here, I've edited it up. So we make sure we edit it down to only include what needs to be in there. And then we double click it to select the whole thing. So if I double click on there, that selects the whole area. I go up to effect and then I find in here, normalize. Click that. And there's not too many settings in here. The only one I'm really gonna play with is the maximum amplitude two. So that essentially says what volume we're normalizing it to. Minus two is where I usually go actually, but some people use minus one. So minus two, minus one, it's up to yourself. I would go with minus two if you don't know any better. Click OK, and you can see that the volume was brought up a little bit there. So it was actually pretty well normalized. But sometimes you'll find that your volume, your recording volume is quite low. It might look something like this. So it's not taking up that much space. Like there's a good gap at the top and the bottom. And that'll mean it's quite quiet when it comes out. So that's why you normalize to make sure that all of your recordings come out at a pretty... Uh, consistent volume. So again, normalize to minus two, and that brings up, fills up the space, but leaves a little bit of gap at the top and the bottom.